And if it looks like we were scared to death Like a couple of kids just trying to save each other You should have seen it in color Now I've been up since like run 55 I turn on WRNS to hear the to guitar pool announcement Here it is right here 95.1 WRNS presents the 15th annual WRNS Guitar Bowl. Back at MCAS Cherry Point with Low Cash. Take this hometown home. Annie Bosco. I'll be your neon, baby. Dylan Marlowe. Presented by John Stars. We knew about Low Cash and Dylan Marlowe. Oh, no, not Dylan Marlowe. I was thinking Dylan Marlowe was Tucker Whitmore. Because here's the picture like, of the silhouettes they posted. And Mikhail always like turns down to brightness or whatever and uh, brightens it up. And this is the picture Mikhail got from it. But we thought, well, I thought the guy to the far right was Tucker Wetmore, but it actually ended up being Dylan Marlowe, which he's good too. I was thinking the top girl was Hunter Girl, but I didn't put it in the comments on the VRS page. When I was right about her, we knew we were right about Low Cash and Zach Top. Low Cash is the two guys at the top, and Zach Top is the guy with the cowboy hat in the middle. And we did not know the other girl to the side, but we really didn't know if Hunter Girl was the girl on top or not, for sure. But I was just guessing that. So, yeah. Oh, and I did not say this earlier, but I am home myself because Grandma had Arch Pullman and Charlie McCullough are both at work. So, yeah. Oh, and they moved the guitar pool to Havelock this year. The first year we started going it was in Goldsboro. They just moved it from Havelock. And every few years, I think they moved it back to Havelock. So, this year, they moved it back to Havelock. And instead of being on a Wednesday night, it's on a Tuesday night. I was thinking it's going to be Wednesday the 20th. It ends up being Tuesday the 19th. But I was close enough because it's always the week before Thanksgiving. What else was I going to say? Um... I think Austin's going to try to go with us this year because Zach Top is going to be there. So, yeah. Austin has never been to a guitar pool with us, but we're going to try to figure everything out because he's supposed to be moving to a new location for work next week or the week after next. So, yeah. And I'm pretty sure if I ask my best friend, Megan, to go, she would love to go. So, that's the possibility to get three sets of tickets, which we normally do. That's six people. So that's enough. Because normally my best friend goes, so that's five tickets. So, yeah. All right, so it's 1.45. I did not say this earlier when I was talking about guitar pool because I just forgot, but my ears hurt from where I had friends for a long time. That's not what I really want to talk about, but when the guitar pool is in, in Goldsboro, it's at the Maxwell Center, like the convention center. And, you know, Goldsboro has the military base, but it's, in Goldsboro, it's not at the military base. But when they do it in Havelock, it's at the military base. It's going to be interesting. It's going to be something different for us. We don't know where to line up at this event center. And we've never been on the military base for the guitar pool. We've been on the military base for the air shows and stuff but we've never been for a guitar pool like I said I know I feel like I'm repeating myself and we had tickets for last year's guitar pool but we did not go because that's when grandma was in a coma in the hospital and all that stuff and we were just going through a lot of the time I was actually kind of excited if it was going to be there Michaela and Charlie kind of weren't but I came to the unanimous decision well not really unanimous important decision not to go because grandma was still in a coma if grandma was not in a coma and not in that bad of shape we probably would have went but she was in very bad shape even if she went in a coma and was in bad shape i wouldn't have went but we just didn't know what we had at the time so we did not go here lately i've not been playing disney dream Light valley i've been playing the epic mickey revise on the Nintendo switch for those of you who don't know, this is a game me and Chloe used to play when we were younger, and it came out on Nintendo Switch last Tuesday. 
And last Wednesday, I got a new Dream Snaps on Disney Dreamlight Valley. And I've not done it yet. So it up, see if Epic Mickey Audio saved. And it does, like, at certain points. And I don't know if I've done one of those points yet. For it to save, like, so it's not too far back that I do go back. So I've missed a Dream Snaps before. So what's another Dream Snaps missed? Ain't no big deal. I haven't, like, got first or second in Dream Snaps ever. I'm normally, like, in the thousands, thousands, thousands. So... I guess I could play Epic da 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 play Epic Mickey for a while into the next update of Disney Dreamlight Valley. Which will probably be sometime this month, I would think. So I'm just gonna play Epic Mickey until then, unless I get bored of Epic Mickey and then decide to go to Disney Dreamlight Valley. We'll see, so yeah, talk to you guys later. but your friends oh that's a whole different game that's your draft pick friends are those people who jump into your life like they were born there like they've been waiting in line since the beginning of time just to be in your life they're the ones who see you when you're down busted up and say hey get up you got this they ain't obligated like family they ain't gotta love you but they do anyway they got your back when your family don't even understand what you're doing now let's be real a friend is somebody who knows you're crazy and still loves you. Somebody who laughs with you, cries with you. And when the chips are down, they're sliding them chips right over to you saying, Eat up, we in this together. So let's celebrate the friends that chose us. Stand up one at a time, uh -huh. in their turn, chronological order.